Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Emerald Extreme Randomizer Nuzlocke. In the last episode, we got our fifth gym badge. Uh, I'm going to show you off the team really quick. We got Petunia, the Dragon Normal Flygon, Chlorophyll, Blaze Kick, Dragon Claw, Cut, and Swords Dance. Sniffle, the Grass Psychic, Dug Trio with Giga Drain, Extra Sensory, Sunspore, and Cross Chop. And, uh... The forecast ability, which I don't think does anything unless you're cast form. Uh, Cave Gal, the Amistar, flying in poison type. The Shield Dust um, ability. That's what it's called. It's called an ability. We got Poison Fang, Air Cutter, Arrow Blast, and Acid Armor. Saladments, the Gardevoir, with Strength, Charm, Protect, and Payday. And Saladments is a normal type with Bolt Absorb. Um, and Ace the Blaze again, Bug Poison, Color Change Ability, uh, Sludge Bomb, Mega Horn, Silver Wind, and Revenge. And finally, we have Bill, who is just a Surfer, a fully normal type Psyduck with Surf, Wing Attack, Fury Attack, and Double Team. Um, surf, again, is just uh, to get us around. Um, but yeah, so in this episode, we're gonna go through here. And I don't think we get an encounter here. Because it's still Route 118, isn't it? Unless it changes... No, it's still Route 118. So unfortunately, we do not get a, pi a Pilo Pilo Swine. Unfortunate. So, uh, yeah. I'm going to This is actually the route where we got that, um... The Mewtwo that uh, died. Uh, but yeah, so Stevens here is going to tell us some stuff. Is he actually going to give me anything, or was that just a really weird random? Um, so I think we're still in route- dang, we still can't get another encounter, that's really sad. Uh, but let's get- ooh, citrus berries, those are good. We like citrus berries. Citrus. That's very good. Um, yeah. So, wait a second. I know that guy is probably going to fight me. Sweet! We got the good run. Alright, so next time we need to get an encounter in the water. We know about that. So, let's see. We have to fight this guy. Salad Mince has not been healed. Uh, we're going to lead with Ace. He's probably going to have like a bunch of magic co Oh, hello. Um, I don't think we figured out what type... My Lotic is, so I'm just gonna spam Megahorn because I'm too strong. I uh, still don't know what type of Lotic is, and it would be tough. I'm pretty sure we just punched out that Oh, oh, for some reason that, that looked like an explosion. Uh, I'm a fighting type now. Uh, I don't care, right? Correct me if I'm wrong. Why is it hitting all of these dynamic punches? Wait a second. Cape Gal, like, super resist this. Ooh, that's scary. Alright, so it's looking like this is a fighting type. We're gonna hit it. Um, air cut is gonna kill, right? 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 right. Thank you. Alright, cool. Yeah, that's interesting. That's a, a fighting type there. Why do I already need to go back and heal? That would be nice. If we had fly. Uh, but we don't. So, I'm gonna come in here and heal. Uh, just because we weren't healed before. And, uh... Ace took a lot of damage. Uh, we're moving along. So this is not an encounter. I wish it was. Uh, but it is not. Because it's not a new route. But I feel like this way might be a new route. There's a new item. I feel like that could be useful later. Is there anything I can use in my bag? In my bag. Uh, no. Oh, I can give this to... Uh... Oh, I took it away from Ace. I just realized I took that away. Um, but what we can do... Let's give the quick claw to someone slow. Cape Gal can't be fast. Uh, but yeah, that should let me pick up an escape rope. And then if I find future escape ropes, it shouldn't take up. Alright, Route 123. This is a new route. 
how do we want to fight these people? There's gotta be an item here, right? There's not. Wow. Shame. Alright, um... Yeah, we're just gonna lead Ace. Uh, that's scary because fire, but it's also not fire because this game is randomized. I just realized I'm not using a choice band, so it might even be better to start with sludge. But oh, okay. Rapidash is weak to bug. That means it's either grass, um, psychic, dark. That's it, right? Interesting. Oh, uh, that's cool. Awesome bug Pokemon! Wait, we had a grinder. What type was it? It was ground, right? Wasn't it ground? I think no, it was fighting. It was fighting. Yes, detect. That's a fighting. Um, I'm just gonna air cutter since Grimer's not too big of a deal. It probably won't kill, but I don't think it can do anything to me. Is that quad resist fighting? Yeah. And it's just gonna keep detecting. But yeah. Cape Gal is actually really good. I wish we had some special moves, because I'm pretty sure Cave Gal is a special attacker. Leftovers? I'll get rid of something in my bag for some leftovers. Um, I wish I had something to use these stones on. But, we can. There's gotta be something I can use. Guess I can give someone some more PP. I'd sold that. I don't have anyone. You know what? Take a Mystic Water Bill in case you ever have to use Surf. Because we definitely want the lefties. Yo. Oh, I, I can't get an encounter here, can I? Oh, that's frustrating. I can't get an encounter until I come through the other way. Dang! Yeah, unless there's. I just don't want to go by this lady. Uh, but she's a spinner. She can... Okay. Uh, yep. Yeah, nope. We indeed cannot get me out of here. That is disappointing, but we will move forward anyway. Um, so yeah, this is not an encounter. We already got the Mewtwo, technically. We didn't actually get the Mewtwo, but... Oh, boy. Just die to this, please? Alright, so... So, basically, in this episode, we're gonna be going up this route. Basically, until it's the 6th gym... I don't think we're gonna do the 6th gym today. We basically go up this route here, 119. We're gonna try and avoid trainers, just because there's a lot of them on the way up here. Find items. It's a bunch of items. Uh, Ven oh, wait, wait, wait. This is our encounter. This is our encounter. Okay, so we have a Venomoth. Not exactly psyched. Do I feel comfortable sending out Sniffle? Send out Petunia first. See what Venomoth does. Oh, ice! Okay, get out, get out, get out, get out. Alright, um, so we're not sending in Sniffle. Uh, go back to Ace. Huh, how do we hit an Ice Star? I don't think we actually do. Hyper Voice! I'm a normal type now. Um, let's just see if I can throw a Pokeball and see if it does anything, because I don't know if it can't be that hard to catch, can it? It's not that great. Aurora Beam, that shouldn't do too much to me. I'm an Ice type now. Maybe try another Pokeball. Yeah, you just uh, shake here and then shake again. Nope. All right, wonderful. I was gonna keep spamming Aurora Beam. I, ha. Uh, I guess what I could do is I could switch to Salad Mints. Salad Mints actually is really good special defense, and Salad Mints can use like Payday. 
It's only, it's level 25, it's not like a super low level. Nightmare. Oh. That's a move. Oh, it's a ghost. Why are you taking me items? Um, ghost ice? Is that what type it is? That's actually a pretty cool type. I just can't do anything to it. Another Pokemon, I guess? I think I just gotta start chucking balls until this gets in. I'm gonna use speed up. Did that drop my attack? Or my special attack? <gasps> okay. And excuse the little opera. Um, I don't know if that was a crit or if it just Gardevoir has a lot worse of a physical defense than special defense. Uh, but that was kind of scary. So I'll probably just stay here and chuck out balls. I'm gonna swap up Mr. Ace here. And yeah, I'm just gonna keep throwing Pokeballs. You know what? Since I'm doing this, I might as well check the Great Balls. Alright, there's no way this thing can take another Great Ball. Perfect! Alright. There we go. I should have just done Great Balls from the beginning. Uh, but we're gonna nickname this Moth. It's Venom. It's Moth. Carnage Moth? I can't fake Carnage Moth. But, uh, you can be Carnage. And, uh, cause there's a Carnage movie. Instead of Venom, it's Carnage. It's funny, because uh, it's, it's a joke. Alright, there's gotta be an item here. A quick claw. I already had a quick claw in here, and then I put it on something. I need to get rid of some items. I need to sell some stuff, because I think... Like a Soothe Bell? I don't need two of those, do I? I could probably sell one. I could probably sell... Uh, you know what? I already have a Quick Claw. I'll just try and remember that's there, just in case. Um, that guy's not gonna fight me, is he? He doesn't look like a trainer. There's gotta be a healing station in here, am I right? Heal me with your Wingo! Nope. Why do you have six Wingo? This is... Wow, okay. Uh, but this has become a new route when we move up here. I feel like it might. That lady totally saw me, but she decided to spare me. I'm going slowly just so that I can see if we ever change a new route. Because if we change to a new route, that means I can catch a new Pokemon. There's a person there. Oh, they're probably going to double battle whoever comes. So far we have not changed to a new route, so we do not get a new encounter. Another lava cookie. Okay. This guy's gonna fight me. Oh, no, he, he wants the double battle. Ha! Well, joke's on you. Alright, this is not a new encounter. It's not a new route. Uh, okay, so we're gonna get to the, uh... This. Okay, so what is happening here is, uh, Team Aqua has decided that, uh, they want to take over the Weather Institute. Uh, but what we can do here is there's a bed and a PC, so we can check on Venomoth and see, uh... What's up with it? Oh wait, I just realized. We have a bunch of stuff in the box. This is going well. I, for some reason in my head we didn't have... What? It's just ghost... It's not ice, it just has Aurora Beam. And Hyper Voice? Hyper Voice is actually a pretty solid physical move in this game. Though does... Do we have good physical attack? Actually it's not bad. Um. I think Carnage is still gonna stay where it is, though. Okay, so, I think in this episode we're going to take out Team Aqua, 
uh, get that cast form, and that'll probably be it for the episode. Um, I think we're gonna lead Petunia. All right, show me what you got, Zatu. I feel like this might be a dragon. I could be wrong. That's why I thought it was a dragon, but that wasn't super effective. So it's either the dragon steal, or it just randomly got dragon nets. Oh, it got greedy, it got greedy. We're good, we're good. Oh, that is terrifying. That is extremely terrifying. All right. Uh, Petunia's level 31, and that's it. All right. Uh, we're going to fight this guy. And we're going to quit meddling, except uh, we're not. We're going to take out this ghastly... Because Ghastly is actually really, really frail. I did not see what it was. It was a spiel. That's adorable. I'm actually super sad that we have to kill this uh, But it's super weak. We should be good. And next one... Actually, these levels are kind of catching up with us. It's level 27, was it? I just... Blast it. Alright, and then there should be like three battles up top and then the uh, admin battle. Don't speed up going upstairs. Uh, so we're gonna do the uh, don't do a double battle strat. And she's gonna have a Hitmonchan. And we're just gonna Dragon Claw in hopes that it's not an ice type. Actually, if it's a fighting type, that, it is an ice type. That's terrifying. I'm gonna kill it next hit though. Ice Ball isn't strong on the first one, it's just strong on the later moves. Oh boy. Mr. Mine. This is actually the Pokemon that ended our first run of this Nuzlocke, is a Mr. Mine. And it was an Ice type. It used actually Ice Ball. So that's kind of crazy. I feel like I can just use Mega Horn and it'll die. I don't know what type it is, I don't think we've seen it on this run. Not very effective, my shoe. That was extremely effective. Wow. No wonder I gave Ace the choice band. Nothing can survive a choice band in attack from Ace. Actually, I think I am going to switch it back to the choice band right now. Uh, not use, give. Uh, Ace. Already holding a cleanse tag. So I think I gave it the cleanse tag because I was trying to go through a wild. Yay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't have any repels. Um, wait, I have speed up. I'm just gonna... Whip, 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 Alright. Now we're good. That's terrifying. That's extremely terrifying. Okay, so what are Registeel's stats? It has... It has 150 in both defenses. Oh, this is scary. I feel like it's about to explode, but I don't... I mean, it's not a regular register. It's a it's a ground type. Oh, no. You're not lowering my accuracy right now. No, don't do it, Registeel. Okay, I can take a mud shot. Yeah, 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 okay. I just have to hit another Dragon Claw in its style. In its style. We're good, we're good. See, we hit. It didn't go down. That's bad. It's fine. Even a crit won't kill me here. It looks like Mudshot is its best move. If it was Earthquake, a crit might kill me. Alright, I was waiting for it to use Earthquake right there just because... Uh, uh, I'm gonna heal. I'm gonna heal. I'm going to use a... Soda Pop. I need to get more of these. Luckily, after the next gym leader, who should be in the next town over... After Winona, we should be able to fly, which means I can go back and get Soda Pops easily. Actually, wait, in Lily Cove you can buy Soda Pops, right? They, that's where they have the, uh... Okay, we resist Fire Punch, we're good. Just hit. Okay, we're good, we're good. I'm gonna switch out Petunia, though, just so that we have, um... So that we have our accuracy back. Dunsparce. Oh, okay, we can take on a Dunsparce. Uh, I'm gonna send an Ace. I have the choice band again. I just put the choice band on, so I feel like there's no way to survive. Uh, but yeah. 
I feel like if that Registeel had some, like, really good moves, that would have been really, really awful. And we're good. I don't think the crit mattered. Not very effective, though. Maybe. I don't know what that could have been. A plan's being spoiled by a kid? Ha! Couldn't be. We're too elite of gamers. Alright, that guy's next. For the sake of being extra careful, we're gonna go heal, and we're gonna take on this guy. And after this, we got whoa! Wait, 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 wait! How many? How many Pokemon do you have there? I sped up through it. Razor, we can take a Razor Leaf. Resist it, Dragon. Dragon is a good type. Honestly, like Dragon is a really, really good type. In uh, gens before fairy, Anerith. I think I'm good. Okay, he only had three. I thought he had like four or five, and I was uh, genuinely scared. Uh, that is a focus punch. We're good. We're good. Swablu. That is a ground type. I know what type it is. Sniffle can take it out. I never use Sniffle. I I feel kind of bad, so I'm gonna do it now. I really hope I don't regret this, but I have Giga Drain. It's a ground type. I should be able to figure it out. Sniffle's good. Sniffle's got this. That is really weak sauce. That is extremely disappointing. I think I stay in though, because I resist. Um, but I don't know what to do. Extra sensory because there's a lot of PP. Come on, prove yourself, Sniffle. Okay. There was still that little bit in my head, little part of me in my head that was like, it's gonna survive, it's gonna kill you because Doug Trio isn't very defensive. But it's a swap rule. I shouldn't worry. Alright, we're good. So, once again, going back to heal. Alright, so this is. Um, a fight. I imagine she has three Pokemon? Might have four, but I think it's three. I think we lead. What does Salad Mints have? Does it have Charm? So if there's a really, really, f like, physically strong Pokemon, we can just start charming it. Um, Strength really isn't that strong on a Gardevoir, though. Maybe we should leave with Cave Gal. Actually, I think that's a play. I really, really hope I don't regret this. Uh, she only has two! That's go- <gasps> This is super effective. I think Cave Gal just beats Blaziken. Holy cow! That was terrifying, because I think we've seen a Blaziken before, and it, like, did a lot. But, um, we can't get poisoned, because we are a poison type, and we resist. We got it, we got it. It was a speed type? Yo, that's weird. Cave Gal's speed- wait! Wait, Aeroblast can miss? It's fine, Air Cutter is gonna kill. Wait. We speed tied with a Blaziken? We're lower level too. What the heck? Is Cave Gal secretly speedy? What? And a Sandshrew. Okay, yeah, we won this. I am gonna switch though. Um, just because I don't remember what type Sandshrew is, but I feel like it's we've seen one before and it hasn't actually. I should have switched into a into um, Tuna. Cause this guy's got special defense. Or no, he's got physical defense, not special defense. So I should have used Dragon Claw. Ah, uh, but it doesn't matter. Even resisting the Sandshrew can't take a choice banded Megahorn from Ace. I am disgustingly strong. Thank you for noticing. Bad enough to Team Magma, but now there's you. Makes you want to stiff around in our business anyway. We have a situation. Team Magma's here. They're going for Mount Pyre. What? Can't waste any more time. You're gonna hurt Vampire. 
Thanks to you, we're safe. Take a Pokemon. So it's a cast form, but it's actually not a cast form. It should show here. Oh, it's a Murkrow. It can't evolve in this generation either, so it's going to be a Murkrow forever. It's a ground type. There was Murkrow in the route where I trained. It's female. I guess we can call it Moon Bird. Because that makes a lot of sense, doesn't it? Just say yes. Don't worry about it. It's a Moon Bird! Alright, so uh, we got our encounter. Should we do the May fight? It's been kind of a short episode. I thought that would take a lot longer. Uh, let's look at Moonbird, though. Uh, it's a ground type. Why do you have a Mystic Water? There's literally no reason for that. He knows Fissure? <laughs> Yo, that's kind of good. So Boomerang's going to be the uh, stab move, but it knows Mist Ball, too. any wonderful moves. Fissure, I can only use if I'm higher level, and even then it has bad um, accuracy. Um, probably not going on the team at the moment. Robin and Pinocchio are definitely the ones that are most, like, up for uh, evolutions. Um, Helix actually doesn't evolve until, like, level 40, so probably not until I get to, like, the last gym. Actually, no, Tate and Liza might have level 40. I'm not sure. Um, but definitely not for this gym. I think I can evolve Balloon, Floof, and maybe like Slug before the next gym. Maybe also Bill. Uh, so we'll see. But yeah, I think we might just be able. Actually, wait, there's a kid over here. Doesn't he give me something? Nope, he doesn't. Thought he did. Uh, but there's a May fight. I think we're gonna go into this May fight the same way. We're gonna have Cave Gal leading. And after this May fight, we should be able to just go straight. No, 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 Another experience share? How does it work when you have two experience shares in this game? I don't know, but I definitely want to take it. We could sell this. Actually, no, I'm just gonna remember that's there, and I'm gonna go do some selling, um, probably in the next episode. Um, but should we take on May? She is gonna have four Pokemon. I, I, I'm pretty sure she's gonna have four. Uh, she may have like a level 33 or something now. Am I ready? You know, let's find out. Maybe she only has three? Oh, she only has three. That's great. Mag Cargo. Isn't that what you're supposed to have? Hold on. Wait, why am I afraid this is a ground type? We had a ground type one of them. But I don't think it was this run. Should I just Aeroblast anyway? If it's an electric type, does my cargo have good special attack? It might actually. Um I'm scared. I don't know what to do. You no, know I think I'm gonna move into Ace. I feel like Ace kind of resist a lot of things. If this is a fire type though, I'm gonna be mad. Oh, it's using um, Skull Bash. So it's a normal type? I should be able to take that. I'm a normal type now. And this fighting move should be super effective. Okay, probably gonna need to switch though, so the ace, um... Okay, Cave Gal's leveling up. Ace is 34. That actually may even be above Winona's ace. Oh, yeah. Cave Gal just super counters Blaziken. Why does everyone have a Blaziken now? Huh. Um, this is a higher leveled one than last time. We've also leveled up since then. I still don't think- oh, that did even better. Uh, Sludge Bomb isn't going to do anything. Yeah, because I super resist. 
this blaze again. It's nice that we're getting Pokemon that we recognize, though, because if this was a Swampert, I would have no idea what to do. So I'm not mad. Just interesting, you know? And a Sea King. We don't know what type that is. Let's go into Petunia. Give Petunia some action, a chance to prove herself with a Dragon Claw. Since there's no fairy, nothing can... Oh, that's a... It is a steel type, that's right. But that's fine, this is actually still a good place to be because we have Blaze Kick, and that's just gonna destroy the Seeking. Never mind, that is a defensive boy. Is it really defensive, or am I just really bad? Okay, so I lowered special defense. I'm pretty sure this thing only has physical moves, so I'm not super scared. I am a little scared because, like, a special attack is gonna insta kill. But Doom Desire is physical because it's steel, and in this generation, all steel moves are physical, and that still do a lot of damage. But we're good. Uh, this Blaze Kick is not gonna take out the Seeking, but it looks like Doom Desire is its only move. And as long as this Blaze Kick doesn't miss, this should take it out. And we have defeated May. Petunia got a lot of experience there. Dragon Breath. There is no reason for me to learn Dragon Breath when I have Dragon Claw. Unless I want to paralyze somebody. Yeah. I'm strong, yeah. But I believe I'm strong. Um... Oh! That's... that's Fly! But I have to get the gym badge before. Okay! Well, chill out, Scott. What are you doing? Uh, but yeah, so... Fortree Gym is our next stop. And yeah, wait, is it this person that gives me something? Oh, okay, he was just telling me about the cash flow. There's someone here that gives me like a TM. But I may be wrong. At least I thought there was someone who gave me a TM. Hello, sir. Yeah, no, no one gave me a TM. I'm disappointed about that, but I think that's gonna do it for this episode. Um, we're doing, we're doing pretty well right now. We've got, um, a bunch of Pokemon in the PC. We have a really solid team, I'm gonna be honest. I think everyone got a chance to do something today, even though I never send out Sniffle because Sniffle is super, super frail. Uh, Petunia, actually I don't think Salad Man's really did anything today. But Salad Man's did something in the last episode, if I remember correctly, so we're sitting pretty... Um, in the next episode, we're gonna go, we're probably gonna take on Winona, but there are a couple of encounters we can also get before Winona, uh, so I'm looking forward to that, uh, but I think that's gonna do it for this episode, thank you so much for watching, hope you have a wonderful rest of your day, and I'll see you next time.